Hello everyone, I am back with another vlog after a very long time and today I am going for a grocery. So I just wanted to share the experience as a student doing grocery in France. So let's go. The last few months have been very busy and tiring and stressful for me so I wasn't able to make some vlogs but yeah I'm back and I will be sharing some few more in the coming few days as well. So it's 28th of December and I'm in Lille. My classes are officially over and now I'm just here for a few more weeks until I get my residence permit. So today I'm going to this mall. Uh, there's a store called uh, Leclerc. So I will be doing some groceries and then I will be sharing my experience. The last few months have been very tiring and amazing in a different way. I did a lot of new things. I did uh, travel to different countries and I will be sharing more of them in the upcoming videos. But today I am here to this mall called Lillinium and I'm going to a grocery store. In France, there are a lot of grocery stores and the most common one is Carrefour, which is even in different countries all over the world. And But I'm going to Leclerc because of their uh, different offers and I just like the store and the thing in France is you can easily get halal chicken meat any kind of uh, meat you want uh, obviously not pork uh, that would be uh, halal and that's because there's a overwhelming uh, population of Arabs especially in this northern region of France so it's easy, you can get uh, even restaurants with halal, the Domino's next to my residence is uh, serves halal uh, food. So yeah, it's uh, very convenient and easy if you are looking for halal options. I kind of regret not making a lot of videos of me going to university and attending the classes. Because uh, it's not easy to make vlogs all the time and it's also very tiring. So I kind of regret but nevertheless I still made a lot of content and in the future I will aim to make more. So this is the store which I was talking about, it's uh, Leclerc and it's a nice big store with everything you want. Here I am and I always start with the vegetables and fruit section so let's go there. I usually don't buy a lot of things because on the start I used to buy a lot of things and most of them used to get wasted so I just get the essential and bare minimum stuff so it doesn't get wasted because uh, it's not easy to eat everything all the time. <laughs> so I will get some bananas. Some bell peppers as well because I like to add them in pastas. Green chilies are not readily available in France. I don't know why, but this store have it and I really like adding them in my omelette and sometimes in my food as well. So this is something I really like, so I will be getting some of these. The rest things I don't think I will use, so I won't be buying anything else from here. We get the stuff and weigh it and we add it here, just like any other supermarket. New Year, they have these special, uh, I don't know what we would call, some special packages for dry fruit. So it's nice of them to make some New Year stuff. This is sushi and stuff, I don't need them. This is refrigerated vegetables, not of my interest, more seafood, seafood, so this is the halal section which I was talking about, you can see halal on the top and all this entire section is for halal food and then that is different which is non-halal but yeah I can get something from here so this is promotion area and just like these sausages it says halal yeah and i use them for pasta and um, uh, omelet so yeah i will get these then i need some chicken breast which i can maybe get it from this side so yeah now uh, this is too much for me 
I couldn't find any better so this is it this is one kg of breast pieces and it's probably for nine euros and 25 cents in France there are a lot of Turkish people as well and they have this iron thing which is just like lassi uh, in Pakistan or India and this is really like good uh, it's like milk yogurt milk and it's called lassi in my country but uh, in Turkey it's iron so yeah I will get some of these just to test and it's for 70 um, cents I'm done with the meat section and now I will be going to the breads and see what I need so these are the traditional baguettes uh, and like a lot of locals like to have them and the sandwiches even in France are made on these breads uh, baguettes and it's very common and there's different types of them some are hard some are soft and it depends on the bakery uh, which is called lingerie here and you can enjoy one of these if you really like them but I'm not a big fan of them because uh, sometimes they are too hard but if it's made really well and warm then it can be really nice as well another thing I really like here is pa o chocolate and it's like a kind of a croissant with chocolate filling but it's not croissant it's pretty different but yeah it's one of my favorite these ones I, I like are these because these are easy to like eat because all of them are separately packed so even if you open the hole you can still enjoy each of each of them fresh so I like these ones but the one there are fresh and but if you open the box then all of them will get you know dry in no in just a couple of days so this one is more suitable for me so I need this some buns because I already have some patties at home so I just want to use them and this one looks pretty nice and there are four of them so yeah I can get these time to get some eggs and milk so the more eggs you buy the better price you get so I will be buying some eggs from the section so these are 20 eggs for 5 euros and 29 cents which is much cheaper than if you buy 6 or 12 so yeah per egg it's cheaper so yeah we got to save a bit with the bulk buying section is for milk and I would just buy one of them because I just use it for coffee and nothing else so yeah it's not worth buying a lot of them done with my checklist but I will just see if I need something else maybe some snacks I used to buy these yogurts in the start but I stopped buying them because they are kind of expensive but I can maybe have them since I am leaving soon so yeah just before going I can have some more this is the dog food section this is alcohol section I need to buy something related to cleaning let me find I want a lint remover uh, the fur which comes on your uh, clothing after a wash or maybe just wearing them so I just need I ran out of mine so I'm searching that for now this is the thing which I wanted but I already have the holder I just need the refill so I will buy these and I also bought uh, this to clean it's also a refill kind of thing I will just add it on my broomstick and use it for cleaning the floor so yeah now I'm done but I will just go through some other sections just in case I need something this is the candy section which I don't think I will buy anything today but I also have rice pasta and tomato and everything else oil and stuff so i don't need anything else for today but yes it was fun sharing with all of you i don't need anything from this section they have all the masalas and everything one could need these are the sauces and different type of things which you can add in your pasta and food this is pesto pasta here to check out and I will just join a line and get done with it here in France you don't get the shopping bag 
for free. You have to buy a big one, like the one you can see in this trolley. So I have mine in my backpack. So everyone brings it from their homes. They buy it once and then reuse it every time, and which is a very great initiative and should be followed everywhere. Now I'm done with my grocery and I must say it's not easy to film in a grocery store but I still did it and it was a new experience for me. I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you some other day in some other video. Thank you guys.